Hello, my, my name is Gabriel from Gaba QSC. In this video, we are going to continue with the training about how to become a computer te technician. So if you see this video for the first time, I recommend you to see the playlist so you can see the, the rest. So in this case, we are going to talk about the dependability and responsibility. So if you don't know what it is, I'm going to explain a little bit. I'm going to give you f a few examples as, as well. So. A person a dependability is a person that can be count to perform a, this act and responsibility is answerable for his or her actions. And dependability is a person that can be count on to perform those actions. So many times happen that uh, the, the people, uh, some, some, some people are informal and they think that uh, becoming a computer technician is just uh, showing up with a screwdriver, a couple of CDs, uh, and that's it. So many times um, when you have a customer or maybe you're hired for, for a company or something like that, and then you try to go to a customer and then you say, okay, yes, I'll go in a little bit, but you, you really don't show up on time. So that is, is very important in today's society because if you are going to fix a computer in a customer that is a, is a business and they are counting on you and you don't show up on time, they are risking data, they are risking their customers just waiting for you. And if you don't show up, they are going to lose a lot of money. So that is, that is very important. That is why responsibility is something uh, that uh, people have to count on you. I mean, you, ha you have to be responsible and dependable. So that way you're going to be efficient and everyone is going to be able to work with you and everyone will be glad uh, to work with you. So yeah, I'll give you some example, uh, some example. So let's say that you go, um, to a customer and this customer say, okay, yes, I have this problem with this computer. Um, and you're thinking, well, I think this computer has a lot of virus. We have to uh, wipe and reload. And, and if you don't tell to the customer, hey, do you have a backup up to date? Or do you have all your information duplicated uh, elsewhere? Um, maybe they say yes, maybe they say no. And if they say no, you, you should tell them, hey, I have to do a backup, otherwise uh, I don't want to risk uh, working with your computer. Um, if I have to delete everything and you think that you have everything but indeed you don't have it, that will be a, a very bad thing. So in order to avoid all those issues with the customer, it would be ideal to charge extra if that is required. You can tell to the customer those things and you can do the, you can make the, the backup and that way every, everyone will be happy. And if they say, no, don't, don't worry, just wipe, um, reload and do your job. Just, I, I need a computer as soon as possible so I, I, can, I can work. You should have some the paperwork that will tell the customer, okay, sign here, and you're assuming the responsibility that uh, you have everything in place, that you have the CDs, drivers, uh, and everything in order to, to install. Many uh, times it happened to me that I go to the customer, and then before I work uh, on on, the, on her or his computer, uh, I ask, hey, do you have the Windows, uh, DVD or CD? Do you have Photoshop, Word, Microsoft Office, and all the things? Uh, the person said, um, uh, let me check. Uh, maybe they have half of the programs, or maybe they don't have anything. And uh, In that case, you will say, okay, uh, or I have to sell you a new license, or we have, uh, we have to abort because, I mean, if, if I delete all your computer, I, we format your hard drive and everything else, you will not be able to work uh, anymore. And in that case, it might be a good idea just to try to repair the, the hard drive. I, I have a, another video about that, about how to try to clean the whole computer without uh, deleting the, the full, I mean, the whole hard drive and, er and everything else is another, it's like a, about an hour. Any, I mean, I mean, if you want it, just leave me a comment or you can search it on, on my channel. And um, if you want the forms as well, how like a work form, computer work form, so people can sign if, and, and they take full responsibility in case if uh, they, they say they, they have everything, but indeed they don't have anything. So 
that is that is very important. What I recommend, um, I was working with many many people about the. Um, I, I mean, I was talking. Um, I was working with many people, like from different country, like from Germany. Usually, those people, they show up like half an hour er earlier, and that is that is great. Maybe and if you are working in South America or in another country like that, maybe they show up half an hour late, or they don't call the customer, uh, they don't say, "Hey, I'm I'm getting late." So, um, like I said in in the beginning, I want to. Um, emphasize uh, this this is very important uh, try if you are going to do something like that call the customer if you're going to be late um, I mean it will not cost you anything and the customer will be happy about that also recommend I recommend uh, just make a, a backup of everything um, if if the customer say yep I have it make them sign so I hope uh, this uh, video help you and see you next class